Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new pack opening episode of Top Drives. To start off today's episode we have a ceramic uh, pack event finishing in which we did get tier 2, meaning we did get a ceramic pack. It was an Italian event, I got to use my almost maxed out Pagani Sonda R and when I have the chance to do so, uh, I usually do quite well. But before we get into those rewards, I just would like to condemn her. Uh, co condemn, not condemn, commend, sorry, commend Hutch for the awesome pack art again. I love this uh, Jaguar pack art with the XJ220 on the front of it. I do believe this is the version which is a prize card though, which is quite interesting how they would put that on the pack art. But yeah, there we go. I don't know if I will go be going all out for the finals because I'm not very interested in getting the Euros. Uh, but... Um, I will certainly try uh, and have a look at what the, re uh, the, the the requirements are and then we will go from there. I don't quite know yet, uh, but we shall see. We shall see. Anything special from this aluminum? No, nothing special, unfortunately, from that one. And then we should have the other event. I'm not usually this fast with events, so it didn't even have time to load yet. Uh, Mambo Italiano. I went 14-0 in this event, 14-0, and that made me rank 6. Um, very simple event for me, I just used some legendaries and then some filler cars, it was uh, super fine. Uh, let's see, we have the Turbina, and finally... Ooh, okay, I'll take it. I mean, I'll take an Ultra Rare Fuse any day of the week. I do believe I have that particular Ultra Rare. Uh, it's very very quick to check this now because of the new filter. So let's have a look. Oh Let's have a look um, No, see it is indeed new uh, However, even though it is new I don't think I will add and lock this particular one because I don't know if I'm very fond of it That's per perhaps why I don't have it in the first place uh, Because I'm simply running out of slots currently uh, So because of that I am probably going to chill a little bit with that Alright guys, I noticed in the store right now there are some very weird pa packs. We have Carbon Fiber Cash Infusion, which is a carbon fiber, uh, which is normally 1499 and then you pay a thousand gold for 200,000 cash. Then you have this, which is five cars, so it's basically a ceramic, but you get 27, 37, 47, 57, 67, 77, 87 RQ cars only. This is so useless to open, you're gonna pay so much extra for that, no way. No way, dude. But then you have these, which are quite nice. We have this, which is 399. It's not uh, good enough to, for me to buy. But we have this, which I will buy, which is American Frontier Carbon Fiber for 1399. Count me in on that one. Um, I'm gonna have a little look at the odds just because I know you guys like to. Uh, I don't. Uh, not the odds, sorry, but the uh, cars we can get because I know you guys like to see what I have and what I uh, don't have yet and stuff like that so we're, we're gonna look at it uh, Michel, no collections and tags here we go non price cars there we go okay so the only legendary we're missing is the DNX really but you can see we are missing the Ford Mustangs all of them we're missing the really good Viper I'm gonna wishlist that one uh, and then this Viper would be okay too I guess to get I mean I want the Nassau still um, I would like to get my firepower back. I had to fuse that, but if I get that back, I'll be happy too. Like this, I would honestly be happy to get too. But when it comes to the uh, ultra rares, uh, this one is very high on my priority list. I haven't gotten it, so if I could get that, or uh, even the said DX is, is uh, that's what it's called. Uh, yeah, that's also one of that's high on my priority list. So if I could get any of those, I would be happy with that. Also, there's a super rare I'm missing from this pack. Let's see if I might uh, be able to get the other. Oh, actually, quite a few super rares I'm missing. Look at this. Okay, let's wish list these so we know which ones uh, it is. Okay, look at this. Missing so many from here. Okay, my wish list is full. Anyways, let's open it now. Without any further ado, sorry for blabbering along. Let's see what we can get from the American Frontier Carbon Fiber Pack. Perhaps we'll get lucky, perhaps we won't. C2 VTS, we have the XJ6, the Nissan Silvia RS X S12. We got the Torino Talladega. And finally, show me a legendary. No, it's the Neon SRT4, which I already have. 
That is quite unfortunate. I think we're gonna go ahead and open a normal carbon fiber as well, because I feel like I should. Add, add. That was new too. Add and lock. Nice. Add, add. Uh, yeah, let's just open a vanilla carbon fiber too. I have a good feeling about it. I think I'm gonna get an epic from it. And I can get basically anything from this, which is very interesting. So obviously, if we are lucky enough to get something good, it can be absolutely anything. Coleos, we have the V8. No extra super rare. We have the C3. Okay, let's see. Alright, the Vaxolantara. And finally, come on. Epic or legendary? No, it's the Subaru Impressa Gravel Express, which is all surface four-wheel drive, though, which is interesting, to say the very least. I think I am going to keep that uh, for sure. So, at least a keeper, but uh, happy about the drop? Not really, not really. But yeah, there we go, guys. You can't get lucky every time, obviously. Um, it is what it is. Alright guys, just giving you the heads up about the final clip of the video. Unfortunately, I just recorded a video with Leo in which I had to shrink the uh, OBS like record area. Meaning that the video you're gonna see now is going to be uh, weirdly framed. You will still see what's going on, but it's very badly framed. I'm super sorry for that. Rough mistake to make, but I made it. What can I do guys? Let's roll the last video. Alright guys, to end off today's pack opening episode, I have the daily reward, which is a street racer pack. Uh, can be very interesting, and then I have some events finishing as well, in which we got another ceramic. So let's see. Maybe something uh, special can be hiding behind here. Let's see, street racing car is... Oh, the Civic Type R. I do like this car though, the way it looks, but uh, already have it. Don't need another Chrysler for the next one. Okay, I see you. Um, obviously I will be making videos on this uh, That will be coming up So uh, I hope you guys are excited for that But now we are going to go into the events And have a look So we have the daily event first of all Zero here This was the 4 wheel drive daily event That I also did gameplay on yesterday I believe um, So in here we don't expect much It's an aluminum pack You know how it do but maybe we'll get pleasantly surprised, we did not. Uh, unfortunately, just a normal rare. And then we have the Paddington Bentley event, which was the 5x Bentley, where I could use my two legendary prize cars. It was enough for a top 5 positioning. Not too shabby. Let's see what we can get from the ceramic. Perhaps something good. We have the Suzuki Splash, the DBS, the DS4, the Mazda BT50, and finally... The Maserati Racing, so nothing special, unfortunately, from any of these packs. But that is going to be it for today's episode of Top Trash. If you did enjoy it, make sure to leave it a like. Also, as always, if you could help me out by subscribing to this channel and my second channel, that would be wildly appreciated. Down below in the description is a link to my second channel if you haven't already checked it out. Uh, also, if you guys do want to see what I'm currently maxing out, I have an Instagram page where I post every single max out I do. So if you want to head over there, you can see absolutely every max out that I do, so you don't miss out on any of that. And if you guys do want to get a uh, community around your top drives playing, if you want to have a community, if you want to be able to share about your top drives experience to other players, if you want help, if you're stuck in challenges, or if you just want to see what's coming up in Top Drives, check out my Discord server. It's called the Top Drives Hideout. It's completely free to join, open for everyone. Uh, and we have over 1,500 members already, so you can't really go wrong with that. And if you guys do want to support me further, I do have a Patreon as well. With all of that being said, thank you so much for watching today's episode of Top Drives. Until next time, stay safe, have a good one, take care of one another, guys. And goodbye.